ethic, our, our commitment to being great, um, our leadership is all uh, where we wanted to be at this point right now. You know, it's been awesome. We, we had the youth clinic, you know, um, with about 200 kids. That, that, was a, that was an awesome event. The weather, the sun shining. We'll have a picnic here with uh, all the kids' parents and, and the deans of the university. So you can't ask for a better day. And again, the game, uh, we wanted it that way, a competitive game. And even without me fudging it a little bit at the end, it was still a good competitive football game. <laughs> Uh, Cotton played well. I mean, it's kind of hard to sit there and tell. We'll go back and we'll watch the film, but Colin's going to be a great quarterback for us, you know. Um, but it all depends on what he does this summer. It all depends on what he does, you know, in fall camp to improve himself also, too, because, uh, you know, Nate Strock's a good quarterback also, too. So uh, those guys complement each other. Those guys will make each other better, but uh, it's all about what we do from here on in. You know, I think Chris is a big part of our offense. He's a big part of what we do. Um, you know, he's an athletic kid. He's a, he's a role model. He's a leader. You know, so we expect big things out of Chris this year. Both of those guys uh, have the ability. You know, when you sit there and you say have the ability to go 80, you know, those guys have the ability to go, you know, 80 yards. And you look at, uh, at our tight end position with Casey. Casey brings a whole other element. That's a, uh, that's a mismatch nightmare, you know, for a lot of football teams. Uh, he, he said he would have scored if I was out of his way. I think he would have got tackled if I wasn't, you know, giving him a block. But I still got it a little bit. I moved pretty well. I still can backpedal a little bit. <laughs> Our blue defensive line, you know, of course, did a, did a good job. And, and that's kind of how I kind of um, made that team, you know, with the, with the uh, with the white offensive line against the blue defensive line and sitting there putting pressure on the quarterback. The more that we can get four-man pressure, the better off that we will be. Well, I think it's a part of kind of a tradition, you know, here, and I think it's a, um, you know, a huge part of, of what we do. And uh, it's, it's not nothing that is kind of like fly by night. We, we take time and we think about that as a coaching staff on who we want to award, you know, those awards to, and, and it's a big deal. I still have my little plaque for winning the Jack Lambert Award in my office, which is a big deal to me, and I'm sure it's a big deal to these kids when they win these awards. April's a huge part of this team. She's, uh, you know, the way the guy, she got, you know, 100 big brothers, you know, on, on this football team, and they all love her. Um, but she's a hard worker. If you come to practice, there's one person that you see before and after practice out there kicking, and that's April. And, and she's the, one of the hardest workers, you know, on this football team. So she deserves it. Hopefully we can get her in the game this year. That's my goal. No, no, no. <laughs> you ask any of our guys right now, and you know this, you ask any of our guys right now who's the starter, they'll tell you whoever earns it.